Eight News. It's one night, but this event makes Christmas time magical for children who might otherwise go without gifts this year. It's the Ripley County Toys for Tots Harvest Dinner happening this Saturday night at St. Benedict Parish Hall. And there's one man who has worked tirelessly to make sure this event happens year after year. Joining us now is Jerry Linksweiler, organizer of the annual Harvest Dinner. Thank you so much for making time for us. Well, I'm glad you make time time for us every year. I mean, it is great to be here, Diana. I mean, I work tirelessly in endless hours, but it all comes together when you have relationship and have yes. a good team. That's what it takes. And last year alone, you did very well in three hours at the Harvest Dinner. We raised over $40,000 in three hours. Wow. Thanks to all the people there. And this year here, we've even got a bigger and better auction. We have plenty of guns. We'll have anything. We got. In fact, I want to throw a bad boy more in. Mm -hmm. I was here in July on your show, right. and the guy that won it donated it back, and it will be sold. So he donated it back after winning it. After winning it, Mr. Hardy Building in Alapapa Bluff, he donated it back. Wow. And now we're going to auction it off. That's Thanks so Thanks to Pop Bluff Farm and Equipment, they actually uh, did the bad boy more at first. So everything's good. And uh, we're, you know, uh, it takes a lot. We do a lot more now than we do. We, we do the toys. I, we, we served over 600 kids last year total in Ripley County, spent over $40,000. That is incredible. And so you, everyone gets behind you. There, There's the giveaway right there. That's, that's it. All, all the they, folks that showed up. That's by over, right there on that, you're looking at over 400 some kids. Oh that my done goodness. It at the giveaway. And, and they just show up. They don't have to fill out paperwork. No, they don't no, have to do nothing, any of that. Nothing. Just show up. If they're between 12 years old, we never turn no one away. Never, never. I don't care. Never. But everything is gathered through this harvest dinner happening on Saturday night. That's right. There's live entertainment. There's food. Oh, we got the Baker family. They're the grand champion of all of them. The Baker oh, Bluegrass so Band, talented. and uh, they'll be there. And like I said, there'll be a lot of other special people there at the harvest dinner. So, do we need a ticket to attend the no, dinner? No, just, just be there at five o'clock. There's no tickets needed, and. Uh, just show up and come in and we'll have 50-50. We'll have a lot of fundraising things going in the auction and uh, we'll have a lot of baked goods. Oh, we'll get nice. the baked good thing in. Uh, if they got baked goods and they need to, to uh, drop them off, they can at Mary's Cafe there in Donovan. Uh, anybody that would like to bake something, we sure would appreciate that. And if anyone wants to get in touch with you or get a raffle ticket or right. whatever, their your phone number, we'll put that up on the screen, right. and then that way they can find you because yes, so many people support this effort. They do, and it takes a, like a community. It takes a lot of relationship, and we and I have that. I have over 40 people on the team at all times that I could contact for different things. Well, we appreciate you doing this for how many years, Jerry? It's 48 years. 48 Eight years. years. I've been on this. I've been coming here almost <laughs> that. And making Backwards. Christmas dreams come and true. true. And again, uh, that the date when the giveaway for all the Christmas presents will be? December 21st. First. So write that down. December 21st yeah. is the giveaway. Thank you so much for being here today. Uh, it's been a hilarious day to get to come. Yes. And uh, it's all about doing the for the kids. It's all about the kids. It's all and about the kids. Thank and you it, so much. I appreciate you so much. You're welcome. And he had a great day to drive down here from Ripley County, Christina.